Hello and welcome to the Chemistry Department. My name is Mrs McKendrick and I'm the Principal Teacher of Chemistry in Holyrood Secondary. Um, I'm here just to talk to you a wee bit about uh, the progression from S3 into S4 and where students can go from S4 onwards. On the board here, um, S3, your pupils have been following a broad general education and within chemistry we have been covering topics like atomic structure, bonding and properties, acids and bases. When we move to S4, they will follow one of these two pathways, depending on the results that they've had in S3. They will either move to a National 5 class in S4, or they will move to a National 4 class. In the National 4 class, the assessment is internal, there are unit assessments to, to complete and an added value unit project to be completed at the end. In National 5 there's the final exam um, with topic assessments as we go through the year. Success in National 5 leads on to a higher in S5 which can then lead on to an advanced higher in S6. A pass for National 4 can lead on to National 5 in S5 with the ability to move on to higher in S6. So both pathways can lead to a young person leaving at the end of S6 with a higher and if they wish they can move on to the advanced higher in S6. This is a selection of some of the written work produced by our National 4 class. In both National 4 and National 5, there is an emphasis on developing practical skills throughout the course. Pupils will be given the opportunity to develop these skills individually and in teams. Right, right, no, keep going. Keep it there, keep it there. Right, hold over the mat now. This is the board that I would normally use at an options evening, just highlighting some of the skills that pupils will develop during National 4 and National 5 Chemistry and some of the careers that chemistry can lead them to. The Royal Society of Chemistry has an excellent web resource looking at careers in chemistry and if pupils have any questions at all they should speak to their teacher. Finally we asked some of our National 5 pupils what they thought of chemistry and these were some of the words that they came up with. Thank you.